Hello. Hi. I am getting ready to film a very official video, which is why I have my official shirt on. And I thought, I've been saying I wanted to use this, and I'm going to give it a whirl today. You know? We're going to give it a whirl. And I don't know if this video is going to be its own video or if this footage will go into like a wrap up review. This will be the first time I'm really using this. I have quite wet hair, so I am going to get it as dry as it needs to be to go in then with this. If it's wonky, we can always cover it up with a trusty headband and a low bun, my go-to. So I'm going to do a rough dry and hopefully this doesn't scare Frank too much. We introduced him to it by sniffing it, but let's see how this goes, you know. It's okay, buddy. Frank is shaking in his boots. I'm actually going to switch from the brush. I'm kind of combing against how I'm going to style my hair to get volume, but I'm going to switch from that paddle brush to what I think is supposed to be more like, it's a flyaway smoother, but it's also the closest attachment to like their traditional hair dryer. And you can switch directions. Let's see if I can figure this out. Okay, I'm actually quite surprised at how cool the air stayed, and it is faster, but total transparency. Outside of the beauty salon, I have not blown dry my hair in probably four years, <laughs> if not longer. So take that with a grain of salt. I think I am going to pause here, let it air dry a little bit more, and then we'll come back with some product and my curl attachment i do not have product in my hair right now but we will add a little bit once it dries a little bit it is damp but i think it needs to be a little bit drier for this to hold curl especially here in the back so i'm gonna give it a little bit and then we'll reconvene not me watching footage back to make sure that first video went well and realizing i had a stamp of bronzer anyway my hair, I let dry for just like, honestly, only like 15, 20 minutes. And it's still a little damp back here, but I think, I think it should be good to go. We're on this journey together. I do have a couple of things that I might be trying. I might be trying to set my curl with these Velcro rollers. I have never used them before on myself, so we'll see. I have clips to help section my hair. And then while I was at my hairdressers, which... If you're in the Pittsburgh area, you should definitely check out Bloom Beauty Parlor. Sam is the owner and my favorite hairstylist that I've been with since 2018. And she's amazing at blonde, if that's what you're into. She's also just fabulous at everything she does. The salon is absolutely beautiful inside. She curated such an incredible space. All of the stylists there are fabulous and they carry Kevin Murphy, which is one of my very favorite hair product lines, but I haven't been heat styling or using product in my hair. We've talked about it. I usually only use my favorite shampoo, which is now discontinued. And my favorite hair mask is a conditioner and that's really it. But I picked up a few things because she was going to help me on this journey because I do want to start styling a little bit more. And I always love how my hair turns out when I see her. So I did end up purchasing the baby sizes of what I could that was available in a baby size. And I'm very excited for that. I will show those to you really quick. So in my journey of finding a new shampoo, we're going to touch on that in empties because all of your suggestions were great. But she used the plumping wash and conditioner on me and it worked really well. And then I got a mini of the balancing wash to see if that helps. So I will start using those and report back. Also, the bag is gorgeous and fits the aesthetic of her <laughs> studio so well. But Kevin Murphy is a great brand. Let me know if you're 
interested in seeing that. But what we're going to use is blow dry ever bounce. We're going to spritz that in my hair for a heat protectant and also to help style. Then I have the do over. This is their um, dry powder finishing hairspray. It is not a dry shampoo. I think, I think it might be, I don't know. And then <laughs> the bodybuilder volumizing mousse. This is what I would typically go in with when my hair is wet but we didn't do that today. So we're gonna focus on styling it and spritzing it with that kind of a workable hairspray. But I'm gonna go in with the Blow Dry Ever Bounce. It's a lasting hold heat activated style extender. I'm just, I'm very curious. So I'm gonna give that a nice spritz. Ooh, I sprayed it in my eye a little bit, but it doesn't sting. This is a really awkward place to be doing this in my office and also It's just weird, so just keep that in mind, please. All right, let's, I didn't bring my hairbrush, so I'm just gonna use the attachment. I'm going to part and section off my hair. So I'm gonna do a side part today. Also brushing through that product. Brushing the product through my hair, come on. Frank's very interested. Did that smell nice? Oh, you on your hind legs. He walks on his hind legs. He loves body care products that smell nice and it's a constant struggle to keep him from getting into them. Honestly, just with that rough dry, I already like what I'm getting, but I'm going to do one part right above my ears. And I should have said this, I have very fine hair. I have a decent amount, but it's very, very fine. And it's definitely less since I got off birth control and was diagnosed with PCOS, the gift that keeps giving. And I'm just gonna section it into two sections each side. We're gonna give this a go. Okay, I've added my curler. Now, I have the new one, so you switch direction by turning the knob at the top. Frank has run away, totally fine. And I'm gonna put it on high heat. It has three settings. I'm gonna put it on the highest just because my hair is still a little damp and doesn't hold curl well at all. And actually, because this is not a ton of hair, I'm gonna split this into two, maybe. I'm wondering if this above my ear might go up into this. So I'm actually gonna clip that back. Yeah. And then I'm gonna split this into two and start from there. Frank has left the building. He's out, peace out. And let's see if I have this the right way. I do not. I left it on the cool shot for pretty much as long as I did <laughs> the big one. I don't know that I'm going to roll these, but I feel like I should pin them until they fully set and then we'll move the clips off. So I'm just going to gather this curl the way that it is, taking a pin Going to lightly pin it up. Moving on. It was so nice. Okay, gather it up. Moving on. I will say this, I don't think is like super duper faster than I'm actually going to try to do this in one. I don't think it's a lot faster than a curling iron, but my hope is that it holds longer. So I am going to switch this.
Let's see how this curl did because it's a little bit bigger. Yeah, I got definitely a bigger wave, but since these are going to be underneath, I think it's okay. I'm mainly concerned with the top portion. So I'm going to grab another pin and then I'm going to take my do over light hairspray and just spritz those. So far, I will say, hold the cool shot on a lot longer than you think you need it to really help set the curls. Now I need to figure out how I want to section this. So I know that I want to go in front of my ears. Like if I were to take my fingers, all of this, I want to set backwards because I want to do kind of like a blowout thing. This looks nuts. You can tell I'm not a hair tutorial gal. And I think honestly, that should be good for that section. Let me just make sure it makes sense. Obviously, I'm not going for perfection here. Okay, there's that. I'm just going to twist it around my finger and pin it to the top of my head, which is a lick. Quite the look. All right, and then let's see what we're dealing with here. So I've got quite a bit. I almost want to do another section behind this so that I can roll them back. Let's do that. Where's my brush attachment? <laughs> not a professional. <laughs> takes quite a lot of time, I'm not gonna lie, but I think that that's because I've never done it before. Okay, make sure I grab all this loose hair and go again. I gotta switch my direction. I love that they did that, by the way. And also the way I've been doing it is I hold the hair, let it catch, and then I work it down to make sure I get all the ends and then up. monitor just glitched out and did something really scary okay again I'm not too pressed about these being perfect I'm just going to twist that up into a curl now I'm actually going to steal this underneath pin and kind of let that one fall and pin this one up this is really hard to pin these without having a mirror in front of me. I'm like looking off in the distance to a mirror and then I have my monitor of what I'm recording. Oh no, did I not pin those nicely? We're gonna let those fall. We're just gonna let them hang out there for a second. Then I'm gonna move on to this guy. Ooh, ooh, ooh. You guys, this is such a disaster. <laughs> filming wise. All right, switch my direction. <sighs> this is a lot of work. You know what, I don't even think I'm gonna pin that one. I'm just gonna let it live its life. I'm gonna do the same over here because really I want just a little tiny bit of a curl pattern. And what I really want to start doing is we'll focus on building the volume with this top section right here. But I think for science, we might... No, we're just gonna do it. I might have rushed that one. It also didn't pick up as nice as some of the other ones. I am going to pin this one because I think... Actually, let's try to roll it. So then 
you kind of lightly brush it out are these meant to like all right wait 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 oh Jesus sorry mother Let your girl know how to use these. I've watched a couple videos, but that does not make an expert. Unlike what the internet will have you believe. You know what? Whatever. Okay. Final section. Actually, let's spritz. That's going to be key for my hair because it does not like to remain how we do it. Okay. Okay. This is where things are going to get interesting. I honestly think that, that so far this is fairly easy to use, especially if you're more than comfortable with a curling iron. However, I think for the effect that I want to go for, the key for me is going to be learning, take these side things out, it's going to be learning how to section my hair. I want to see, I think I can do this in one. Yeah, and I think I need more in these side sections, but oh, let's see. I'm gonna slide it out and try to hold on to this curl. Ha ha ha, gotcha. And then this one for sure is going to get one of these bad boys. How do I do this? I kind of want to start at the base. Can you do that? Yeah, and then comb it through. I feel like a regular old 50s housewife. All right, to clip that. Hopefully these clips don't leave a um, kink that would be sad okay the rest of this hair what's going on here okay the rest of this hair Can you tell that I'm not professional? This side, I the sectioning. Oh, Lord. I can imagine the people that are going to be like, you did it wrong. For my first time, I feel like it's not the worst. As I try to convince myself and you. That one was pretty bad. But I think hopefully my hair knows what I'm trying to get it to do. Because it has a, my hair has a mind of its own. Trust and believe. I'm going to hit both of those. We're a little slanted. Maybe it'll work out for the best, you know? Switch this. This, oh no, I can hold it the same way. Is that one even worth wrapping up? Yeah. We've committed. I'm out of pins. Let's go ahead and let this guy down. And pin this guy. Okay, let's see what we're working with on the underside. They have fallen for sure, but I didn't like super go into the bottom because I'm not looking to get a curly look. I really just want kind of like a bouncy blowout. We shall see. So I'm actually going to let my hair. Oh, this one came loose. What a shit. What a crap show. Let's let these live their best life for a few minutes. I'm going to go check on Frank, make sure he's not scarred for life. And we'll be back. Okay. I can already tell that maybe my hair was still a little too wet. But let's go ahead and see if we can salvage this and style it. <laughs> oh, I don't know how to take these babies out. 
Do you unroll it or do you like pull the hair off of it? <laughs> That's probably not how you take that out. And I'm using my friend to film so I can't look it up. <sighs> okay, which one did I do last? I think this one, so let's take this puppy out. We might have to do the next session in the bathroom. Oh, that, yeah, that's what I'm looking for. That's what I'm looking for, baby. Frankie! I cannot convince him. You would think that I, like, full-on tortured my dog. He's, ugh, he's so averse to all sounds, and I know that he needs exposure to get used to them but I feel like it's torture so I let him run and he was hiding on the couch downstairs <laughs> and I tried to entice him by showing them that I put it away and gave him a nice extra treat and he's still not with it okay I do need to get my brush for this okay brush just a wet brush and I've convinced Frank to join us. It smells so good. Like, oh, Kevin Murphy's hair products smell so good, but this one specifically, it's so good. So I'm, I'm going to start at the bottom and just brush these out. Cause again, I wasn't looking for tight curls. I'm looking for like a bouncy blowout. And I don't know if we achieved that to be honest with you. Okay. Oh gosh, okay. I'm gonna run my brush through this once just to like brush through that hairspray. And then I'm gonna part <gasps> the volume. Yes, baby. Honestly though, it's gonna be <laughs> interesting because I am not used to seeing my hair like this per se, but Did I do it? Do I have a blowout? I'm gonna send a picture to my hairdresser and BFF Sam and see what she thinks, but like, I kind of feel like a Hollywood starlet. For a first time and for as crazy as I felt doing it, I really like it. I'm gonna just spritz upwards, separate and spritz upwards. Did I style my hair? I'm a new woman. I'm a new woman, y'all. All right. Well, I hope this was fun. I'm gonna keep playing and we'll do a follow-up video to this for sure. I just wanna explain if anyone is new here. I got my Dyson Airwrap for $50 from Alta. I saved up my points for years and spent them and now I need to use it. I wanna give a couple of first impression points. Number one, especially when you're first starting, expect it to take longer than curling your hair. It just, it takes a while to get used to. That said, if you're already used to curling irons and maneuvering them around your hair, I think you're going to be just fine. Make sure that your hair is pretty much dry with just the tiniest bit of dampness to it. That's gonna be the best curl, I think. Obviously, I will let you know how this holds out but I feel stunning and I love it so far I have to say I don't think it's going to be necessarily for everyone but like I said if you're comfortable already with hair tools specifically curling irons I think that you're not going to have as hard of a time adjusting there's a lot of tips that I might not have taken into account I'm going to continue to kind of watch some style videos and learn the best techniques for this also sectioning your hair is going to be huge this side really came out the way that I wanted it to. This side is interesting. I've never had it open like this, so I think I'll continue to play with that. It's something to keep in mind, but yeah, I'm really happy with this. Like looking at myself in the viewfinder, it might not be perfect, but this is a lot better than like a low bun for me, you know? Heck yeah, I would recommend those Velcro rollers, I think, just to like help set the hair. I just, I don't know if these are the best for not creating bends. I see a couple. So yeah, we'll continue to play. And I, I can't wait to use the mousse. If this is the volume without the mousse, we're gonna have to try it with the mousse. So 
I hope you're having a wonderful day. And I will see you in the next one, hopefully. Bye.